Praise God. Praise God. This is Apostle Deanna Dixon. I pray that you are having a blessed day in the Lord. Oh, come on, somebody. Give him praise. Give him glory. Give him honor. Hallelujah. I want y'all to know one of the reasons that I haven't been on here, a lot of warfare. But secondly, I'm doing the prophetic classes, so I really must keep myself like consecrated, um, baby, to hear from God. You can't teach other prophetic people. Oh, let's just be real. You can't teach, preach, do anything if you're not consecrated. Point blank in the story. So, um, therefore, that's why I've developed this way. I was doing the just full audio, but you know that was skipping and oh my God, doing all kind of other stuff. But praise God, praise God. So this is for you all who follow, all who follow God. I'm like me saying just I'm just a servant. You, we follow each other. Come on, somebody, hallelujah. You're the right ones anyway. So, um, God was talking to me, woke me up. He said, the reason why y'all seen so much mayhem, so much killing, so much murder, so much stuff, just chaos is because the saints are not doing what they're supposed to do. Well, come on somebody. Hallelujah. Y'all got to understand we in war. This is not, we're not just living a nice little life and everybody's supposed to just have money and be famous and, you know, just have fun. I, I know most of the people think that that's not reality. That's your reality. If you live in this fantasy world, but the Bible says that we are called to come out of the world. He said, come here, come Come ye and be separate from them. That means we don't do what they do. We don't go where they go. We don't roll like they roll. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. We are always paying attention. God, what must I do? Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. What is my assignment? Am I doing what God called me to do? Am I doing what he told me to do? Come on, somebody. See, the enemy will always try to distract you. Oh, come on, somebody. So God has called a full liquid fast. Notice what I said. It's a full liquid fast, October 21st to November the 4th. I think y'all know why. It covers everything it covers this witchcraft month which is the highest of the year not only that in the calendar of god the jewish calendar we're talking about um from the beginning actually this is starting a new year now i know i know i know people say january whatever the case may be i'm telling you in the spirit it started a new year so think about what the enemy did halloween is the month of the new year we're actually going into the new year well here's the deal the only way we can combat this stuff is not by getting on Facebook, act crazy, threaten people, cursing, doing all that stuff. I, I know that might get a little bit of you, you know, you might feel better. But to be honest with you, we got to go back to what they've always done. The people of God have always said, proclaim a fast. So we can summon God. We can't do anything without God. I'm sorry. I know y'all think so, but that is not reality. The only thing you're going to do is get yourself in trouble. What's trouble is easy to get into and hard to get out of. But the power of God is still real. But God is still God. Because think about it. Why is God allowing so much? Y'all know why. America has sinned before God. It's just like Babylon. It's just like Sodom and Gomorrah to the 10th power. Everybody want to do what they want to do. And then they want to talk about, oh, it's so bad. And you know why it's bad? Because the people have chosen Babylon and the devil instead of God. They don't want to hear anything about God. They don't want to talk about God. And you know how you know? I'm going to challenge you right now. When you want to be close to the anointing, you have the spirit of God. When you reject the anointing, you have the spirit of the devil. Point blank in the story, you can get mad. I really don't care. I call it like a T.I. is. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. So for those that want to go on the fast, fine. Those that don't, God bless you too. We'll be praying for you too. Because it seems like the only time people want to get serious is when they get hit. Oh, it's too late then. You should be praying before you get hit. Oh, I'm just being real with you. I pray for my family. I pray for y'all. I pray for everybody every day. I get up praying. I go to bed praying. I don't even know. I don't even know my sleep pattern anymore because I stay up most of the night praying. Um, get, you know, go to bed two, three, get up at six, seven. I don't know what's going on, but I feel fresh. I don't ever feel out of whack or anything because God got me. I'm not that great. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. But I'm telling you, this is an important fast because on the 31st, that's when they, they already do a lot of sacrifices. Y'all don't understand what's happening. Even with the young man got killed. Y'all don't understand. <laughs> My God, this thing's so deep. It'll make your head spin. Yeah, I know y'all just think people are just being evil. They're not just being evil. They are evil. <laughs> they doing what they doing what they're supposed to do. I know it sounds bad, but they're doing what they're supposed to do. My question is, what are we going to do? Ain't no sense in getting on Facebook, got crazy, YouTube, wherever the case. No, you got to fast and pray and summon God. God be with us. God, please do what you have to do. Keep us strong mentally, physically, spiritually. Help the people, God. That's how we have to do this. So the fast starts on October 21st, ends November the 4th. What, what is it? Pure liquid. That's not smoothies. That's not 
acid. We talking about pure liquid, tea, um, apple juice, um, things that don't have a milky context, no dairy, um, tea, water, apple juice, nothing with acid, nothing with acid. So no orange juice or anything like that. Um, now if you do a smoothie, make sure it's a, a, it's a straight liquid smoothie. You know what I'm saying? But it's time to go and to, to go to a level that you've never been to. Because to be honest with you, I'm just preparing some of you because we really getting ready to go back to the old way of fasting. And God is preparing us because to be honest with you, and, and I'm just going to be real. And I was include. I noticed I said was included in that. We have a church that like to eat. I'm going to tell you right now, it's time not to eat. I don't know if y'all see what time it is. It's time to push that plate back for real and call on the power of God. Come on, somebody. This is this is real. This ain't no game. The enemy wants us to to be um actually you gotta understand what greed is. Greed is connected to pride, selfishness, all kind of other spirits. So he wants us tainted. it. Come on, somebody, hallelujah. You're not gonna die. Trust me, you're not gonna die from starving. <laughs> the devil will make you feel like you are. But the power of God will be so in you being tuned, wisdom, discernment, the anointing, be able to spot demons. This stuff is real. So that's what I want to talk about on this fast and also this live. Now I'm gonna be getting up on here because I gotta talk to y'all about something that y'all probably not gonna like. But you know what time it is. All right, so God bless you. This is Apostle Deanna Dixon calling a full liquid fast per God, October the 21st to November the 4th. So if you're going to go in and get your mind right, get your body right, get your spirit right, ask God to help you. This is not easy. No, it's not. Not a clear liquid fast, but none of them are. But it, but you got to understand you're not doing this for yourself. It's not a diet. This is to get God to move, not just in your life, but others life in this world. We need God. I don't care. We don't need more money. I know y'all think so. Money going to solve all the problems. Or if I had a man, or if I had a woman, or if I had this, or if I had that. Honey, let me tell you something. All that, it, I guess it's okay because that's life, right? But nothing will get resolved without the power of God. But seek ye first the kingdom of God and all its righteousness, Matthew six thirty three. So God bless you. God keep you. This is Apostle Deanna Dixon. Roll out soldiers for that is who we are. God bless.